question I have is um, many Ethiopian, educated Ethiopian Adventists that you and I have known left church work. Some of them even left, left the church altogether. But you, you, you stayed steadfastly, I might add, mm -hmm. um, in spite of challenges, frustrations, and, and your administrative responsibilities and, and so on. What made the difference for you to stay? <clears throat> Why did you stick around? Well, I do. As you have said, there was a temptation of leaving God's work and working elsewhere. There was a time when I was seriously thinking about this. Then I had to come back to myself. And I said to myself, how am I going to live with myself if I do that? If I leave the Lord's work and work elsewhere, Will I really have peace of mind? Will I really have satisfaction? Will I really feel accomplishment by doing that? That was one thing that kept on coming to my mind. Coupled with that, I always kept in my mind what my father has said when I was just a young boy. He said, I have given my boy to the Lord. That's what he announced in the church. Mm -hmm. They used to say that in, the, in those days. Mm -hmm. Many parents, I have given, I have dedicated my child to the Lord. That was a statement they made with a sincere heart, mm -hmm. with a real meaning. Mm -hmm. And I have, I have known this all the time. And I said to myself, if I leave the Lord's work, I'll be breaking my father's covenant with God. That would be sin against me. And then this text in Matthew 16, 26 kept on coming to my mind, strengthening my hands. What shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul? You know, that's a question. Mm -hmm. And that question also was in my mind. I said, what will I gain? If I go, I may get more money, more salary, but that doesn't mean much. Mm -hmm. In terms of being happy, mm -hmm. in terms of feeling productive. Because of all these things, all the temptations that were coming to me from inside as well outside the church, I could resist under the help of God. I said to myself, no, no way. I must stay in the Lord's house. I must stay in the Lord's service. I must be about my father's business. Yes, all these temptations are coming to me just because there is a devil and the devil is fighting me and I should not be defeated. I should defeat the devil. Therefore, I kept on saying to myself, stay here. I stayed here. And the longer I stayed, I enjoyed it the more. And the more I saw the product of my work, fellows like yourself, my one, uh, some of my students who are doing now, I felt this is worth going through the problem. Mm -hmm. This is worth saying no to this world and saying yes to Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. And that's what I did. Thank you. That's wonderful.